Welcome, everyone. I'm very excited to be here today with Diane Wiesinger, who is going to be talking to us a little bit about her upcoming presentation titled, What Would Mammals Do? Welcome, Diane. So excited to have you presenting for Gold Perinatal this year. Uh, just wanting to know a little bit more about your upcoming presentation and wondering, what do you think is the biggest challenge parents face when it comes to birth and breastfeeding in today's society? Oh, I think the biggest challenge is a very simple one and a very hard one, and that is simply to trust the process. This is birth and breastfeeding are a process that works well in every other mammal. It just can't be that complicated for us. Uh, it, I realized a while ago that other mammals don't even know they have milk. It's, they certainly don't make a fuss about it. They don't know they have it. And here we've gotten all wrapped up in the process of milk. Uh, birth was always a lot simpler. Certainly, um, new techniques have improved birth for those who need improvement, but it's really done a number on the people who are having ordinary births. Uh, so yeah, I think um, normalizing the process and accepting that if it has worked for other mammals, it just can't be rocket science for us. Thank you. Such an interesting idea, and I certainly agree with you that uh, birth and breastfeeding do seem to become very complicated these days. So another question for you, what do you feel is the biggest challenge that perinatal health care providers face when it comes to helping moms with breastfeeding after birth? After birth? Uh, I think the biggest challenge is recognizing the continuum between birth and breastfeeding, that if we don't work really hard to normalize births, we're going to have to work really hard to make the breastfeeding work. It flows one from the other. And uh, one of the points I'll be making in the talk is that there's much more concern about getting the birth to go well among people who work with other mammals than about getting the nursing to go well. The one follows so much from the other. And we've made it into two separate categories. There are the people who work on birth and the people who work on breastfeeding. And what we really need to do is begin working together again. Wonderful. Such an important point. Thank you so much for joining us today to talk a little bit about your presentation. And really looking forward to hearing your presentation on Tuesday, October 21st. Thank you, Diane. Thank you, and I'm looking forward to doing it.